you need to add texture to your sculpture. So there are a few different ways that you can do this. One of the ways that you can add texture is to um, add it under the paint um, tool. So if you select the paint tool, you can choose a skin texture. And as you start to add this texture, it creates kind of this visual texture on here. Um, so that's one way you could add texture is through painting it. You can also use texture within the brush tool. So if you go down here to texture, um, it'll create a race texture. It's very subtle unless you increase your intensity. So here I've increased the intensity quite a bit and you can start to see, especially if I look down from another view, you can see this texture that I'm kind of adding here. Um, it's kind of a bumpy raised texture to add interest. Okay, so that's another way you could create texture. I could also use the square with the brush and create kind of some square textures. Okay, um, that one I have a hard time feeling like I can make it look more realistic with it. So I'm going to just turn off the textures. I'm just going to work with the brush tool. So this is what I want to show you is that I could create you know, kind of a texture just with the brush tool, almost like scales by overlapping it. And I can even, even going even smaller could really create that. So if I back up again, I have a much smaller brush size. So see how I could kind of create this little texture. Another way that I could create texture is through creases and pinching. So if I wanted to add some texture here to the front, I could take and do some creasing. Right? And if I look at it, you can definitely see that texture here from the front. And then if I wanted to make it even more pronounced, I could pinch along there and define that just a little bit more. So that creates that texture there along the top of the head. And then last but not least, another way you could add um, texture is to use the inflate tool. You could even make the radius kind of small. And this could create, again, that kind of dot pattern or that line pattern if you wanted to. Um, so that could also create some texture. In areas if you want it. Okay. So those are some of the ways that you can add texture. Um, you can also, like where I've done some of this creasing, I could also take and inflate some of the area next to it to help play up those shapes that I just created. Um, so those are some of the things that you could try in order to add some texture.